Hello there everybody, this is game 2 of the best out of 5 randomized matches with the Game Dreamer and uh, of course I'm gonna get an unknown, eradicate and, a, and an Azumarill. Uh, yeah, Azumarill isn't that good with a huge power, it's actually terrible. But yeah, anyways, let's see how this is gonna go. Are we gonna... Are we gonna even up the score? Are we gonna mess up even further? Let's see. Um, but yeah, let's get right into the battle. Um, he got a Raichu, and that's uh, Raichu is so good against my team. I, I know it's so worthless. I'm just gonna try to do as much damage as I can with Hidden Power. He's gonna go for Thunder, and he's gonna crit me. No, it's happening again. Don't let it happen again. It's. Ugh. Anyways. I'm gonna go into my uh, Blossom, I'm gonna go for Sleep Powder, by the way I'm using this uh, visual effect to make it look kinda, kinda like you're playing it on a Super Nintendo, I hope you're gonna like it, I mean, it's just to try it out, okay, it's just to try out some things, anyways, uh, he's gonna switch out into his Xatu, as I'm gonna hit my Sleep Powder, and he's gonna go for Sleep Talk, but he's gonna wake up so it's not gonna work, I'm gonna go for Hidden Power thinking it's Hidden Power Rock, but it's hidden power ground, and he's gonna go for drill pick, and he's gonna crit me again, and that's absolutely terrible. Two crits already, I'm down four to six. It's not looking pretty whatsoever, so... I'm gonna go into Typhlosion, I'm gonna go for Thunder Punch, but he's gonna switch out into his water type, his Polyrath. He's gonna do a quarter, kinda. So I can't stay in, he's gonna go for Surf, and in comes my Pika Blue, which is absolutely... Uh, he does have belly drum, but you know it's Azumarill. It, it has really low attack, like, and no stab. Uh, I mean, no physical stab in this gen, so it's really not as great as he is in the current gen. So now in comes his Grizzly, his Ursaring, and uh, then I'm gonna go for belly drum. I'm gonna decide to go for for belly drum. I mean, let's try to do as much damage as we can, but. He's gonna decide to curse up, so yeah, this thing is like a mini Snorlax now because it's uh, it's really problematic um, dealing with Ursaring with the current team that I have. As you can see, plus six, uh, minus one from his curse. It's not gonna do anything, and he's gonna easily take me down with just plus one. Just plus one is gonna easily take me down. That's crazy. That's absolutely crazy. His team is just better than mine, he's gonna end up getting another crit, another crit to the counter. And, uh, Miltank can't do anything but stall out with Growl, and that's just really bad for me. It's just like, what can I do? I'm gonna try to go for, for Body Slam, I'm gonna get the Paralysis, but knowing his set, as you can see, um, Return is still doing too much to Miltank. All I can do is just stall out for a little bit, but it's not gonna, it's not gonna do too much. Um, the plan here was like use enough growls so I can have him like basically have a safe switch into Typhlosion and start hitting him in the special side and pray I don't miss. And he got another crit. And that's absolutely ridiculous, why are so many crits happening? I don't understand, this is not Gen 1. This is... this is magic, this is black magic, I don't know. Uh, anyways, I'm gonna try to go for more growls, and uh, he's gonna wake up, return is doing less, and uh, I'm gonna try to do some damage before I switch out, I got the paralysis, but then he's gonna set up another curse, and that's really bad. Uh, so I was thinking, okay, you know what, let's do more damage and then go for more growls, and then finally, I just wasn't feeling safe switching out instantly into Typhlosion right away, because, you know, Ursaring, he finally got fully paralyzed, am I gonna switch out now? No, I wasn't feeling safe yet, I still wasn't feeling safe, so I went for another growl, but he's just gonna go for another curse. And it's basically like nothing happened, he's almost at full HP, I went for Body Slam, maybe I was gonna get a crit, no, of course I wasn't gonna get a crit. Okay, I think I'm close to switching out here, I'm sorry about all this. It's like, put yourself in my position, how am I gonna stop this thing? It's a monster, it's a mini Snorlax as I said. And against my team, 
Eradicate, Azumaro, Unknown. How am I gonna do with this? I don't know, but we're gonna try. Okay, it's it's never give up, never giving up. Um, that's how we do. He got fully paralyzed, I'm gonna go for another growl. Uh, he's gonna go for another curse, and now he's absolutely at full HP. So, I have to go for another growl. And he's gonna go for a return. I think when I saw that damage, I was like, okay, I'm gonna recover here. And I think after this turn, I'm gonna switch. I actually forgot. I don't know. It's a lot of stalling, but what can you do? Yeah, right here. Finally, I'm gonna switch into Typhlosion. He's gonna go for another curse. And then I'm gonna go for Fire Blast. I pray it doesn't miss. And it did a decent amount, and in comes his return. And yeah, after all those growls, it's luckily not a two hit KO. <laughs> so yeah, he's gonna decide to switch out, and I wasn't in a position to like predict a switch or something like that. Nah, 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 nah. And uh, Polyrath just beats me. He beats Radicate because it's a fighting type, he beats Cyclosion because it's a water type. All I could do was like try to do as much damage as possible. Come on, a little bit of luck, paralysis. Let's see if I'm gonna live this. I did live it. Okay, come on, Typhlosion, we can do this. We can do this. And uh, I wasn't confident in Thunder Punch killing at that range, and I decided to switch into Eradicate. It's probably a bad idea, but after all I went through with all those crits, what do you want me to do, man? What do you want me to do? And Body Slam is gonna get a crit. Come on, Eradicate. A little bit of luck. Uh, I see it very difficult at this point, but we need everything that we can get. Come on, we got the Super Fang, it's... Oh, he's gonna counter it! Oh my god, that's crazy! I did not see that coming, and I also didn't know that counter worked on Super Fang, that's insane! But Typhlosion is not gonna have any mercy on the A-Pom, and he's gonna send them out Carrer. And uh, he has four Pokémon left. And it's, as I said, it's very difficult. He's gonna send in his orange juice, and uh, it's a speed tie. I'm gonna risk it, and I'm gonna lose it. Oh no, oh no, this is bad, this is really bad. I only have one Pokemon left, and it's the Mill Tank, so I have to go for Body Slam, try to get as much damage as possible. Pray some luck, yes, okay, Paralysis, let's go. We have some luck, we can do it, hopefully. I don't know, it's gonna be difficult with that Ursaring, but he got the full paralysis, and I think at that range, Belly Slam can do it? Yes! Okay, we did it, but... Okay, he has three Pokemon left. What does he have? He has his Xatu still left. Can Miltank do it? Can Miltank get all the hacks back? I don't know, let's see. We have to try until the end. And if not, we have to do it in the next matches, because we still have one more chance, actually. But the rain is finally gonna end. Actually, it doesn't matter, but we don't know if it matters, because we don't have... We don't know his last Pokémon, but... Oh, in... Ah! Oh, another crit from Miltank! Okay. Oh, but his unrevealed Pokémon was a Sudowoodo, and Sudowoodo and Rock types in general completely completely shut down the mail tank so basically this is over i think yeah it's absolutely over and we have to do it in the next match which is gonna be third gen so yeah hope you guys enjoyed stay tuned for more let's pray for better luck next time please and allons -y.